What's up, YouTube? I'm Choctopus. Welcome back to more Pokemon Duel. And we are hopping right into... I'm not even going to waste time here. We're going to hop right into the Grass Gym Cup, which just started a few days ago. And the reward is one of the, the Rotom uh, forms. And this one is actually a lawnmower, which is pretty funny. Um, I don't really know what it does. I haven't looked into it, but let's see. Electric Grass type Mo Rotom. Uh, our artificial turf is its ability if this Pokemon is on the field and is not affected by a special condition Your MP1 grass type Pokemon game plus one MP. That's pretty OP because it doesn't say um, You could have a maximum of three MP so you could essentially have a four MP Pokemon I'm guessing I haven't done it yet. I haven't gotten all my wins yet um, Let's see 130 leaf storm. Oh my goodness revert uh, this Pokemon change form to one of your Rotom so I guess you can switch to was that the refrigerator rotom i mean one of my biggest gripes with recent gen pokemon is i feel like they're kind of running out of ideas in the sense where they're moving towards everyday things um i don't know it's just it's kind of weird to me but let me know in the comments below if you got your mo rotom yet we're gonna go in we're gonna play some matches i'm currently three and oh with the grass deck that i built um, in my last video, if you haven't seen that, link's in the description. We're gonna go in and play right now. I modified it a little bit, so, you know, instead of going the Rowlet through Decidueye, we're just gonna go straight Decidueye, because I think it's gonna be more beneficial early game. Um, being able to move through Pokemon early instead of having to wait to evolve, just, I think it's better. Um, besides, all Grass Pokemon get plus 1 MP up to 2 MP, and Ice-type Pokemon get plus 20 damage. But the team that I built actually gives a nice damage boost because of the, uh, the Lorantises. So, alright, we're going up against El Funky here. Funky new mode, and we get to go first, which is a huge benefit. So it looks like they're running a primary Grass-type. They also have Tapu Koko on there, um, and Poplio. All right, so we're going to start with our Lorantises because they're all 3 MP. Um, and the more Pokemon I have out, the bigger damage buff, I almost said bust, that I get. The bigger damage buff. So we want to get all of our Lorantises out there. And I think it maxes somewhere around plus 40, so it's pretty wild. They're not wasting any time here. Oh my goodness, are you kidding me? To start, to start. And I was 3-0. I feel like we're going to be 3-1 and one after this. Okay, so there's Sceptile. Let's see, who do I want to put up against Sceptile? Um, plus 91. We're about the same, so let's see. Are they running a hurdle jump? Do we have to worry about that? We kind of do. So here's what we're going to do here. I feel like I should block it because even if I move someone towards the goal, if they l use a double chance and they hit a stealth, then it's really gonna screw me. So let's do this. Um, I'm going to take out my Sceptile to block. I'm gonna end turn, I'm not gonna fight here because if I lose the fight, I lose the game. Now they're either going to hurdle jump me in which case I'll have to use my, uh, um, I'll have to use my goal block. I probably should've taken out someone else, but my Sceptile can't miss. So it's just, it's gonna come down to, okay, so I saw this happening. Knew this was going to happen. We're going to have to goal block here. Not exactly how I wanted to start the game, but... It's okay. We can recover from this. All right. El Funky. You are... How many wins? You got a couple wins. So, you, we're both trying to keep the win streak here. All right. Let's see. Let's see if this deck can hold up. It's It's been holding up pretty well. That's right, take as much time as you need because I talk too much and I'm always on a time loss. Double chance, so you're going for the win here. If we can land blue, we're safe. All right, so basically if they hit their white and respin, game's over. Oh my goodness, that's what we needed. That's what we really needed. Okay, so from here, let's take out Lorantis. Now, the threat has been neutralized. I don't really have to worry as much now. They use a lot of their plates. You know, double chance is gone, hurdle jump's gone. I only used gold block. So we're, we're good right now. And I do have a max revive if we need to use it. Let's take this entry point. Do they have a second Sceptile? No, it looks like they only have a Grovile left. And Sceptile seems to be their strongest Pokemon on the team, so 
That Cacturn is pretty scary, though. I haven't pulled a Cacturn yet, but Cacturn looks pretty scary. All right, here comes Coco. Let's, uh, let's block. Actually, I think... Do the Cocos cancel each other out? I think Fairy-type cannot move through. I don't know. I didn't really read this. This is too much for me to read. Uh, let's see. This ability on your turn... No, it looks like they can. When Pokemon, I just uh, can't get knocked out via grass type. Um, let's see. I don't know what I'm talking about. Let's block you. Let's go here. In that turn. So if Poplio wants to come to us, they can. Yeah, Coco's the one who, when this Pokemon is on the field, blah, blah, blah. All right, here comes Cacturn. We're gonna send you out. I really wish I had a counterattack because I would have baited it. Okay, so I think a good opportunity here would be to fight this Grovile. Um, but with who? So we're getting a plus 32. So we can outspin them. Let's do this. Let's take a double chance here. I'm gonna go for it. I'm gonna go for it. We have potential to win this. It's gonna take a couple turns because they're gonna move, but it's okay. They have Shift Tree, which also has, boom, so I'm talking about Spirit Shackle. We are not gonna respin that. Goodbye, Grovile. All right, so Shift Tree has an ability to basically use the gold block whenever. So I wonder if that's what they're going to do, but Personally, I would have moved Shiftry. Okay, so let's go up here. I'm gonna end turn. Um, I'm safe from a, a surround because they need to move two Pokemon to do it. My next move is probably to move Lorantis without attacking and see if I can just get the surround. That's, that's what I'm gonna try and do here. Okay, so they're not gonna let that happen. Um, I'm gonna get rid of that Coco now because they don't have anybody to take out. Coco's gone. Now they have Grovile on weight one and then I'm gonna go move back to the entry point. We're gonna slowly chip away at them because that's our best chance of winning. All right, so it looks like they're doing it. They're attacking, they're not attacking, but you kind of just set me up here to take your pack turn out. Um, you know what? We can go after the shift tree. They have a pretty big purple. Ah, uh, they can hit fan away though, so that's gonna push us. Oh no, it just puts us on weight. For some reason, I thought it was gonna knock us out. All right, so what's gonna happen? I feel like they sacrificed so they could get their septile back out. So that was that was probably bait. Although Cacturn, I don't know. With the twenty times spin, it's kind of scary. All right, so we need to we need to survive this. Melee, melee, wish, we're good. Um, I'm gonna end that turn. I'm gonna move. We're gonna take Sceptile back out. Grovile's not as scary, so I'm not worried as much. I have a feeling Grovile's gonna move across the top, though. Let's see. X attack. They're gonna attack me. Okay. Let's see what happens. Okay, so it's not gonna be enough. Spirit Shackle is going to knock him out. Um, we are going to go here. So now they have two Pokemon that cannot enter. Uh, they're down to Poplio and Shift Tree. So we're pretty golden right now. All right, if we don't die here, we're good. And then, let's see, we're gonna use Bulu to knock you out, and that's pretty much the game. They can't go either way without without losing now. Do they have any plates? Nope. Come on, hit it. Hit the forfeit. I'm waiting for it. Now we're just waiting for it. I wonder if they're gonna run the clock out. There it is. Taking away the first win. And you know what? We're gonna have to play one more. I'm gonna keep this this box streak, the box, box, words are hard. We're gonna keep this box streak alive. Even though I normally open my boosters as soon as I can, I'm opting out this time because I think I have a good enough deck to get to 11 wins, but we're gonna try. All right, we got one more. Let's 
play one more, try and go 2-0 today, but I'm really enjoying this deck. This deck is super powerful for the Grass Gym Cup. Super powerful. And just because they already have a damage buff, now they have a movement speed buff. I'm starting to sweat. It's getting hot in here. Woo! All right. Let's see. Um, also on three wins. Got two Decidueyes, but it looks like they're going from Dartrix. Let's see. What's up? What's up? What's up? How are we going to do this? Um, Blaziken, Mewtwo. Are you running a Mega? It's getting hot in here. No Mega. Okay. Evital. So you can't really move through me. Um, that double spin is scary. So you know what? We're going to move here. Not going to move all the way up because... Let's see, do they have a hurdle jump? They do. So I would have lost my Sceptile there. Alright. Um, let's take one Lorantis. Let's move right here towards the towards the goal. I'm going to have to give up that, that entry point. I'm okay with that. Let's take our second Lorantis. Move here. Now we're getting buffs from both of them, so that's plus 20 so far. Okay, here comes Evital. Um, let's get a Ghost Pokemon out. This way we can Hurdle Jump naturally. Boom! Mega Spin! That's a knockout! Oh my goodness, I forgot about that. That worked out. I just got myself really excited because I forgot about Decidueye's ability. Um, come on, let's get everyone up in here. Clutch. Very clutch. <sighs> Alright, you gonna attack? No. Here comes Bulu. Alright, so now the best thing for them to do here would be to block. They're not gonna block. They're not gonna attack. So you could say goodbye to Evital. Now they have no choice but to move their, their Blaziken. In which case, I'm going to take their other entry point. Wait, what happened? Did they not... Did they just lose? What happened? What did they do? Oh my goodness. Free win. Alright, so we're gonna we're gonna take that second victory. I am undefeated with this deck so far. We are going to continue this in the next video, so look out for that. We're gonna go for 11 wins. Thanks for watching. That's all we got for this video. If you enjoyed it, smash the thumbs up button and subscribe. Uh, you can find me on Twitch, social media, all links in the description below, Discord channel, MySpace, Friendster, AIM. <laughs> Click all the links. Thanks for watching. Have an awesome day. See you later. Peace!